Hundreds of people took to the streets of New Haven today in support of the Sickle Cell Disease Association of Southern Connecticut. Sickle cell is an inherited blood disorder most prevalent in people of African ancestry. News 8's Keith Kuntz has the story. At East Rock Park in New Haven, they came out to walk and run because they care. Paya Green here to support young Tiana Jones, who suffers from sickle cell disease. It's the first year you've done it? Yes. Okay, you excited? Very excited. This is the 25th year of this walk, and over the years it has grown incredibly. Today, there are hundreds of people taking part in this walkathon. Gary Smart, who's on the Sickle Cell Board of Directors, has been a part of this walk since the very beginning. He says the money raised here is critical. And we're building a, a larger infrastructure now, which really uh, is important and critical uh, with this particular walk, especially uh, since we're opening up a, a new home uh, for sickle cell patients uh, in New Haven. They will uh, serve the sickle cell patients in New Haven and Fairfield County. As always, this year's walk brought out fraternities, sororities, and civic groups. Everyone here to help and support people like Earlene Pemberton, who suffers from sickle cell. So what is it like uh, living with sickle cell? How it's hard, but I can manage it. A day of fun to support a cause that's fighting to help those suffering from a devastating disease. In New Haven, Keith Koontz, News 8.